video on this FXR jacket. So we've been looking at, actually Trevor got an FXR jacket a few years ago. Yep, from, from a friend. friend of ours, mm -hmm. um, from working for him. And, um, and it, it's super heavy and all that. And I had a North Face jacket when we first moved to South Dakota that just from the wood burner, it's got like holes in it. It just needs to be replaced. So we've been looking for FXR, FXR jacket for a while for me and um, where we live and how cold it gets. Brian was adamant that this is what we get. So um, supply right now sucks really bad. So um, our local store, Shield, we went down, tried them on, um, just because women's FXR, at least this one, this is an edge, they go by number sizes, they don't go by small, medium, large. So um, I knew I wanted to be in like the six to eight range probably, but I felt better trying it on. So, this one's an eight, um, six fit perfect, but it's winter, we're gonna wear sweatshirts, we're gonna wear sweaters. I don't wanna be feeling like I'm super bulked up and tight. So this is like sort of the perfect size. Um, so before I try it on and show you, um, it has a, a liner that you can take off. Um, so these jackets go by rating. So it says like without the liner, if the warmth is at like a two, and with the liner, the warmth is at like an eight. Um, it has to do a little bit of research on what that what their scale sort of means and in, in that in that aspect of it um uh so it is um waterproof um all that it's these are actually really good for snowmobiling jackets so um anyway this is an edge i can't remember what we were looking at the first there's there's a whole bunch of different um fxr types so you have your four buttons down here. So if you're out and you are snowmobiling or skiing or whatever, this will sort of lock you in. Um, you can go like to the tighter setting or the loose. Um, so the tight's kind of nice because it just kind of. Tries to help stuff coming in underneath your shirts. Yeah, so and then if you can pants. see it kind of tightens everything up here. And I'll zip it up. So right now you see I zip it up and I have, I have a decent amount of room in there. Um, I guess the six is like a, a great fit. It just, if I were anything bulky, I think I would feel like I'm just like too tight in. Um, it has like the thumb holes and um, so for this, you can tighten your sleeves here. I haven't, I just got it. So I haven't done a whole lot with it pockets here, these zip here, and there is a pocket on the inside here um, for all your stuff. Um, I left this out and open because it sort of talks about everything that it comes with, you know, um, so sort of their technology system, the polyester series, um, how the waterproof. So this is something that we were looking at, the 20,000. I think at the store, we were looking at one. They went from like five to 10, um, or maybe it was based on the eight GM. I can't remember how they had it at the store. But when we came home to look online and we found this one, this one is actually higher than all the ones they had at the store. Um, anyways, it's, like I said, water repellent, um, like the removals about liner, there's a seamed lining. Um, I guess talks about the zippers. I always blame it that we live up uh, by our, our brothers and sisters of the north in Canada mm -hmm. because, uh, you know, we get cold, poor, really cold here in South Dakota. But, yeah, so this FXR is made up in Canada. Melissa pointed out yesterday we are sort of chuckling. Yeah, he's like, we live in Canada. We need that. It's kind of funny. So, anyways, and they have some vent vents, too, on both sides. Yep. Some vent zips. So, if you need to open those. Now, I had a sweatshirt on yesterday and this, and I was like dying in the car, it was so hot. I told Brian, I'm like, hey, we're going out and doing, it has not been negative temperature no, here, so, so we'll have to see. But I had like a t-shirt on doing chores with this, and I felt great. So, um, it definitely is a lot warmer than, um, uh, you know, than my North Face one was. Anyway, so, I don't think I've been here too. <laughs> on both sides. Not on both sides. I think that's a pocket, maybe. I don't know if this one's a vent. Oh, you know what? This they said something about skiing, so putting something in here. Oh, skiing. there you go. I don't know. I seen it online. I'm not a skier, so I have no idea. Um. Anyway, so that's 
an FX R jacket if anybody's in the market for a new jacket, a new winter jacket. You should go and get Trevor's and get the older version that's four years old just to show, you know, that one possibly. Yeah, I can guess I don't that. know where he is. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> but, yeah, so we, we, I get Carhartts from work for free. Nothing wrong with them. But uh, these are different beasts, and uh, this is like more wind resistant versus a car heart, and it would shed water, which is what you're looking for if you're messing around on your sled or whatever. And you know, these aren't cheap. Anybody in the snowmobile industry and you know, stuff like that, outdoorsmen's and women, you know, this was about 340 for the price of the jacket and stuff. But if you look at us, you know, as, as a, you know, more mature people and you're not out shredding it on things, you're gonna have this for 10 years before you need a new jacket. And, you know, it's well worth it to stay warm uh, when you're out messing around, so. Yeah, well, we've been here for how many years? Like 11, 11 now? Yeah, since and we And I can... had, that's how long I had my other jacket. Yeah, and, and she still could get by with it, but it burned up and it was just thinner than what you'd want for living up by Canada. And she yeah. sweated out with the wood burner. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. so I, I anticipate keeping this for a whole long, a lot, long time. But anyway, yep. nice little jacket for what it is. You might, um, like what we had to do was go try them on in the store. They didn't have any, so I sort of gambled because they had a ton in the store and I felt like it was too big. Worked out for me, um, but you might have to go online. A lot of places did have them online, different sporting goods stores, but you just really have to play with what sizes and... The one color that kept coming up was this white and gold, and I'm like, no freaking way, because it's going to be so dirty in five seconds. Yeah, look, it looked cool if you were, Uber had six of these different types of jackets if you needed, and you weren't, if you were just, hey, I'm going skiing this weekend, I want the white one, but for real people, no, I mean, like the boss said, it'll be, it'll be toast in a minute, you'll be, it'll be different colors, right, you biv? Yeah. So anyways, great jacket for the winter if you're looking for one. Yeah, here okay. it is. Have a great day, everybody. And uh, don't show when I post this, but Merry Christmas. <laughs> See y'all.